Tony D and Little Jones somewhere in the background. And this is a screenwriter's rant on Jurassic Exorcist, a movie about a priest that goes back in time to perform an exorcism on a dinosaur. Smash like and subscribe. Thank you for smash liking and subscribing. Check out my books. Links in the description. Comedy Horror in South Jersey. It's the Pineys, books 1 through 14, available at Amazon.com. Don't forget, Kindle Unlimited is free. Okay, this is like trauma level of filmmaking. Although, I'll tell you, they're trying to make the best use out of their very limited special effects and budget, obviously. I mean, look at this. <laughs> the plastic, looks like a plastic army helmet. Uh... Yeah, that doesn't look like a, a legit army helmet. That doesn't look like a legit knife or a legit mask. None of this looks legit. But that all being said, it looks hilarious. Like the kind of movie you'd see with your friends on Halloween to laugh at it. I think that's why the movie was made. But that being said, you know, they're earnest about it. About that. What kind of car is that? Uh, can't tell. Uh, so this dude is the priest. And <laughs> you can see the soldiers. Is that a plastic gun? I think I think that might be, they might be plastic guns. But I would totally say this. 100% I would say it. Here's, uh, is that chroma key? Looks like it. So that's the plot of the movie. A priest goes, It's. I swear to God, that's what it's called. Jurassic Exorcist from Wild Eye Entertainment. Um, a guy summons a, a, I guess he summons a, a demon and it goes wrong and he ends up summoning a dinosaur that's possessed by a demon and uh, the dialogue's about what you'd expect it's you know they don't seem to really be actors but I'll tell you for non-actors they're trying I would watch this before I'd watch a new Marvel movie I mean this would at least be interesting you know it would at least be funny to watch i'm giving it an upload i know it's not look i mean look <laughs> it's strictly amateur hour but it's fun amateur hour you know what it reminds me of it reminds me of that movie with jack black and moss deaf most deaf i think that's his name and they ran the uh video rental place and then they weren't allowed for some some happens where they can't they don't have any more movies, so they remake the movies like behind the video place, but they're only like 20 minutes long, but they just star them and their friends. So they remake like Ghostbusters and it looks like it was made for $40 and pizza and, uh, you know, it's basically the movie and people like them because, you know, it's just the local knuckleheads redoing the movie. That's what this kind of feels like. I mean, look, these are special effects you find inside a laptop. And I, I don't even know what this is supposed to be. I guess it's supposed to be a, uh, a, a possessed dinosaur from hell? Maybe? I don't know why the dinosaurs would end up in hell. The dinosaurs existed long before uh, the even the concept of hell was around. But okay. The dinosaur was so evil. Um... So first act, take a stab at it. First act, um, these Satanists accidentally summon uh, a dinosaur from hell, a possessed dinosaur. And it runs amok. And then eventually they contact this priest to, uh, to help. And so he has to go back in time. I guess that's how he goes back through time in order to do an exorcism. Um, so he, he goes back in time, I guess. And then uh, I guess he brings other people with him or they're, they're cutting to, while he's back in time, they're cutting to the present day as the dinosaurs run amok. I mean, look at it <laughs> as the dinosaurs run amok and kill everybody 
and soldiers have to fight them, but they're losing the battle. But as he's fighting his own battle back in time, he manages to complete the exorcism and save humanity. So, or maybe he takes, I don't know, maybe he takes the jets back with him? And they nuke the little valley where the dinosaur is to kill it finally? I don't know. I mean, a lot's going on here. And, uh, and I mean, you've got quality mustache. I'll give you that. I'll give you that quality mustache. I mean, you, you could set your watch to that mustache. Let's be honest. So, yes, I would see this. It shouldn't be a second over 90 minutes, though. Really ought to be like 80, 80 minutes. And it should move. Because if this thing doesn't move, oh, God help you. God help you if you got a lot of long scenes of like, well, when I was a boy, I first discovered dinosaurs. And let me tell you something, I was scared. And then, you know, just forget it. But um, if you keep just jumping from one scene, crazy scene to the next, I, I, I think I could get on board with this. Yeah. You know, as a lark. All right, here's the write-up. A reluctant priest is sent back in time to perform an exorcism on an evil dinosaur. He's evil. Who has been summoned by satanic forces to destroy modern-day Earth. So he's a, re a reluctant priest. I, I don't think I want to go back in time, but you have to save the Earth. I don't really want to. <laughs> All right, I guess I'll do it. Since I have no choice. Damn it, Father Donovan. You've got to save humanity. I don't know if I... Maybe humanity doesn't deserve it. Um... Yeah. So... I mean, kudos for you for making something this crazy. <laughs> you know. Looks like you shot it in a weekend. So that, that must have been a fun time. I, I'm sure they spent more than a weekend. I wonder where they did shoot it. A lot of mountains. Hmm. You know what? I, I want to say Ireland. Are these guys Irish? It, they didn't sound Irish to me. Might be. I don't know. <laughs> imagine, imagine editing this scene. Yeah. <laughs> Come on. Um, but yeah, for 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 the LARFs, I would uh, totally watch Jurassic Exorcist. And that's it for me, Tony D and Little Joan. Check us out on Odyssey, Bitchute, and Rumble for our more base takes. If you can find a more base take, I say, take it. Thanks to all who tuned into the live stream where we did it live. And I did a news blast. So far, I haven't been canceled by YouTube, but the day is young. Uh, hope to see you tomorrow.